Hey guys, it's Jack from DJI Drone Service, and today I'm going to be going over how to replace your front arm bracket in your Mavic 2 or Mavic 2 Zoom. So to do this, the first thing you want to get is of course your new arm bracket and the tools to make this repair possible. So a couple of tools you will need are a 1.5mm hex driver, a Phillips screwdriver, some tweezers, some very thin needle nose pliers, and some traditional pliers. So if you have all these tools, you'll be able to get the job done. So I'm going to show you how to do this. So in order to indicate if you have a broken arm bracket, you'll see that this one is because there's no snappiness. It doesn't want to lock into place. It's kind of dull and it's uh, very mushy. This one on the other hand is very snappy as you can see. Locks closed and locks open. So that's what we want to see. So to go ahead and start repairing this, I'm going to make sure we open the arm. And then as you guys can see right here, so this is where we're going to have to do the repair. So it's going to be a 1.5 millimeter hex key. So we're going to go ahead and we're just going to take this guy out. Alright, so once we have that removed, you can actually begin to see our arm bracket. And in this case, this one is actually bent. I don't know if you guys can see that, so that's why this one isn't working. So we're going to go ahead and grab our Phillips screwdriver and begin to take the arm bracket out. So there's the one Phillips screwdriver, or one Phillips screw right there. So we're going to go ahead and take that out. And you'll see the arm start to close more because the bracket's no longer fully engaged. And this is where you're going to want to grab your tweezers and just begin to pry this guy out. So this one was pretty broken as you guys can see this. This is the broken one and this is the good one. So we're going to actually have to get the rest of that out of there. So I'm going to move the arm a little bit and grab our needle nose pliers. So in this case if yours is this broken you're going to have to get these needle nose pliers and go ahead and pull the rest of this junk out of there. All right, so in this case, unfortunately, it looks like the pin, the broken bracket did damage the arm plastic just a little bit, but this shouldn't damage, it shouldn't affect the way it flies. So we're going to go ahead and begin to install our new arm bracket. So our new arm bracket is right here. All right, and then, so to indicate which way it goes in, um, there's these two little fins on the arm bracket there and there. So you want this fin facing you. All right. So before we can just place the arm bracket in there, we're actually going to have to set it. So to set it, you're going to take your pliers and you're going to grab it by the metal shaft, which right, is right here. Um, you're going to have to definitely grip it pretty, tw pretty tight. Um, just drop my screwdriver there. So you definitely want to grip it pretty tight. Don't grip it so tight that you bend it, but you know, definitely firm enough. Then you're going to take your needle nose pliers and stick it in these two holes right here. So it's going to look something like this. And once you're like that, you're going to take your needle nose pliers and don't do that. And you're just going to begin to twist until you feel it ease up and kind of set into place. So once you have that, You'll actually be able to fit it back into your frame and your arm. So to fit it back into your frame, you'll notice on the arm bracket that there is, my flash just went out, oops, that there is these flat points on the bracket. So we're gonna actually go ahead and put those, line those up with the arm, and then begin to slide it in. So in this case, it actually, this may happen to you guys. If that happens, um, just go ahead and pull it back out and just reset it. So that's definitely gonna happen to you guys. You're not gonna get it your first time, which there's no rush to doing this. So let's go ahead and do it again. All right, so now with that one piece removed, the bracket slid in nice and easily. We're going to go ahead and grab that Phillips screwdriver 
and that Phillips screw, you go ahead and lock this arm bracket into place. Once it's locked into place, we're gonna make sure everything is working by snapping the arm open and close. And as you guys can see, the arm is back to its original state, nice and snappy. So once we have fixed the problem, we can go ahead and put this arm bracket cover back on. And to do that, it's very simple. You just slide it back into place. In this case, this guy's is a little warped from his crash, which is okay. And we're gonna grab this hex screw and just lock it back into place. So you guys will notice on this guy's aircraft, his is a little bent, which is fine. Um, but now you have a brand new arm bracket in there and you did it all by yourself. So I hope this helped you guys out. So now that you got your new arm bracket installed, you guys are ready to go out and fly. If this helped you, make sure to subscribe to this channel to see more videos like this. Leave us a like. I'll see you in the next one.